And as the Fix the Country movement prepares to hit the streets on August 4 in Accra, some of the leading members have given the strongest indication to replicate the demonstration across the country if the issues of concern are not addressed. The movement has joined support from various quarters, including a mix of social and advocacy groups like the Economic Fighters League. Now, leader of the Economic Fighters League, Ernesto Yeboa, says tomorrow's demonstration is only a consequence of government's inaction and disregard for the concerns of the youth. What you are seeing is just a natural phenomenon and shouldn't be seen as any strange thing. Um, rather, uh, if organizations like us, the Economic Fighters League, um, don't come out and guide the process, what we might see is a revolution dotted by senseless violence. We are not looking for senseless violence. We are looking for the problems to be resolved. We want water, we want education, we want infrastructure, we want, we want things to work. We don't have to kill, we don't have to destroy, we don't have to bend down in order to have water. And so that is why social movements like ours is very important in the space and has to be treated with, with, with the dignity and respect. Talk about even fix the country. We issued a notice to the police in accordance to the Public Order Act that we want to embark on a demonstration on the 9th of May. If they did not seek to suppress, suppress like they did, as ending up in the court over two months fighting lower courts to the Supreme Court and all of that, we wouldn't have, have had a situation where today, as we speak, it has spilled over. We are doing it in London. We've already done one in Spain. And now, I mean, something about to happen in Ghana. And even here in Ghana, it is not just going to be Accra. We are doing it here in Accra and we'll be following up in the other regions. It is all because a leadership that is not in tune with the time decided to apply an old method that has not worked. And that old method is trying to oppress and suppress the people. When we say fix the country, what has been their responses? Fix yourselves. And even beyond that, when we have said fix the country, they have been annoyed with us, they have even shot at us. What they did at Deidre was their response to fix the country. I mean, how wicked, how madras can you be as a state? They are simply telling us, I mean, if you sit down, sit back and watch. They are simply saying that we won't fix the country.